<laughs> Hi guys. Today, I don't know how to introduce you to him, but he is the coach of the year 2018. And he's with us today. I mean, isn't that amazing? I don't know what to say. I have a lot to say, but of course, during the interview, he's going to say a lot more than that. And Ian Lajoie is not only the coach of the year 2018, he's also best-selling author and entrepreneur of the year 2007 and featured on a lot of international stations like Fox News and ABC and Town Hall Finance, NBC News, and much more. He says a lot of impre impre uh, inspirational things, and he has a lot, but the most important thing that caught my eyes is uh, a lot of things caught my eyes. So let me give you a couple of examples. One of them is like, he says, winners do. Losers, they say they will do. He also says that don't work harder, work with a strategy. Of course, we're going to talk about the strategy, uh, strategy thing with him. And it's very important to know more about this, but it is very important to know that he believes that every human is different and you are the master of your own success. He says that a passionate performance coach shows you the way to ensure your true potential and your success. It's so amazing and such, such an honor to have the coach of the year 2018 with us on the show, Ian Lajoie. Welcome, hi. <laughs> How are you doing? Thank you, Natalia. Always, always fantastic when, when, when you love what you do. Uh, I, live my, I live my dream every morning I wake up. I wake up really early. And when I wake up, I just smile. And my passion is to help entrepreneurs to reach the next level, to, to having fun. This is all my key to business. So I'm really happy to be here today to meet you and to do this show with you. It's going to be a pleasure. Thank you. Pleasure is all mine, uh, Ian. And it's very amazing when I see like well-achieved coaches who have done so much, especially that you come, you are from Canada. And I know that, uh, I mean, to work with entrepreneurs and businessmen, it's, it's hard because you're leading leaders. But today I'm going to go and ask you from another angle, things that every single person Every teenager, every um, worker in a business place are worried about. Because yesterday I was talking to my friend and she said, ask Ian about the flower thing. I said, what? Do you know about the flower thing? You don't know, right? Me too. I didn't know. <laughs> She's like, she told me that sometimes you plant a flower in the wrong place and it, not, not, it does not blossom. That's what they say. So you have to move the flower somewhere that it, it has a good, good soil in order to bloom and blossom. So my question to you, you have so much experience, but what about the things that workers go through? I mean, people who are working in a business place and they're not comfortable. What do you advise them as the coach of the year 2018, Ian? Thank you for, uh, for all this. Hey, for, first of all, Life it's easy. Uh, yes, it's a roller coaster going up and down. There's you need some water and sun to get a rainbow. But rule number one, and this is my my goal list. My rule number one is to be not happy. I want to be super happy because I'm gonna die. We're all gonna die. One hundred percent. We're all gonna die. So it's just a race to die, right? When we born, same as the flower, you grow, gonna die. But in between, you can you can shine. Uh, everybody I'm talking, for, for me, you are a superstar. The people who listen to me <laughs> are a superstar. Everybody's a superstar. Everybody needs to be happy. Everybody needs to do their passion. Yes, it's not easy to find it. Yes, there's big challenges going through your life. But when you learn how to dance under the rain, when you learn to smile, even is, well, well what worse can happen uh, if, even if you die? So in between, do what passion you. And... It was not easy for me. My last name is La Joie. In English, means the joy. So yes, I was pretty determined to be happy all the time. But it was not that joy all the time. I used to have storm, uh, everything from Canada. I got some snowstorm, massive, <laughs> everything. I, I've been through all those those things. And when you decide to be happy, this is the, the one thing I do. I'm a performance coach. So business, performance, performance, no. Performance number one, guys, 
Like this is just to be happy. If you're not happy, how can you be good in everything you do? So that, that, that's back to the basic. That's rule number one. Um, I think for people working, whatever, they ju just take a white sheet of paper, put a, a line in the middle, and put everything you don't like, because this is much easier most of the time. If, if it, everything you don't like right now. If you don't smoke, you don't like it. If you don't like, put everything, and on the other side, everything on the left is everything you want. So that's super easy thing. So what you don't like, what's gonna rest on the other side is what you want. And when you know that, do only this. This, don't do that. And I think it's the okay. basic thing 101 that people and successful people are smiling. Is it, is it because their success are smiling? Part of, they, they, they do gratitude, they do meditation, they have a routine that helps them for success. But I see you and you're smiling. <laughs> and if you listen to this right now and I'm smiling, you're gonna receive my energy through this camera, through this uh, virtual thing, but you're gonna feel it. So if you feel the good energy and you feel the joy, if you feel the passion, yes, there is, there's a strategy we're gonna talk about later on, but Rule number one, guys, be happy, not happy, be super happy every day. It's amazing. You know, I'm giving this all positive energy to people, but you, you see that workers, if they go, I mean, everybody who works somewhere, they have to be happy and they put the bad things and the good things, the pros and cons, and they make balance. But what if there is problem at the place where they work and this problem with other colleagues? Do you blame the system? Do you blame... Do, who should be blamed? Let's change the question. I mean, the boss or the colleagues, or you think that there are certain type of people, it's their character to be intimidated and not comfortable. Uh, I'm gonna be bold. Um, be and, bold, please, and very bold. Go uh, ahead. <laughs> I, I will be bold because I, I, my, I think the best gift I received was a book. It was my, my, my mentor, my coach, and the book, guys, write it down. The Jack Principle from Jack Kenfield. In French, is Le Succès Alone Jack. So it's, it's, it's a Bible. But you only need to read the first chapter. And the first chapter, <laughs> to be bold, you're under, uh, responsible of your own life, of your own success. So the blame is there. Even you get in your car and somebody hits you, it's your fault. Everything is your fault. If you're successful, it's your fault. If you're not happy, it's your fault. So the blame, so that's why I want to be bold. So it was funny is you, even if it's not your fault, it's your fault. Because if you leave five minutes later, you won't get the car crash or whatever. So if you're not happy, that's your fault. So you're under responsible of your success, of the bad thing happened to you because you decide to have a bad attitude, you're gonna bring bad shit. If you're happy, Smile with the bad thing, the, the good gonna happen, and you're gonna see all the bad when you're too happy won't stare on you. Be sharp, be fun, and people can say it's crazy. Yes, I'm too crazy. I decide to be happy, and imagine what happened in my life. I'm with you. I don't even know how we get universe or whatever. My life is amazing. Yes, it's not easy. Yes, I work hard. Yes, I cry. Yes, I get back from scratch many times. And I was not sure, but I never give up. And I always put that smile on. I say, hey, today going to be the best day of today. And what happened? It was the best day of yesterday of today. So that, that's, that's a little bit my, my thinking about success and my way of life. And Very impressive, Ian. But Ian is saying like he is like a very happy with everything that he has today. And it's his best day, right? Every day you see like that. What gives, you to, what gives you the power? What can you advise to people, I mean, to have that power like you, to feel happy, to go to work happy, to, I mean, it's very hard. You're saying like, everything is your fault. So it's a mindset thing. I mean, isn't it hard to blame yourself for everything in life? I think, for example, because I'm coaching and uh, uh, every word you use, so you just said problem, you said art. I, I use, I call it challenges. I'm calling not easy. Same thing. I never said something art. Yes, it's art. I wake up at 4, 4.30 every morning. Yes, it's art. I took a, a, a cold shower. A cold shower. I don't like it, but I know it's good for me. There's, there's many things that I don't like, 
but I know that the benefit of it, if I wake up earlier, I do my reading, I study, I train, I do my meditation, by 6, 6.30, I just, I just beat my competitor because he was sleeping. And I, I win against me because the, the race, the competition is always against me. So if I want to be the best version of myself, what needs to be done, I have to be done. And after that, it's a mindset, yes. It's a way of living, yes. Entrepreneurs is different. Be happy is different. Uh, there's so many reasons not to be happy right now when everything is going on, but you decide if you get this information, it's, oh, this happening, this that. oh, this world is, no. When you decide to be happy and to, to live in a happy world, yes, there's this thing I'm not happy about humans sometimes, but I try to not get affected by my environment. I decide to get only the good thing, same as what you eat. Guys, if you eat crap, what's gonna happen to your body? Well, I want to stay fit and good. Same thing here, same thing here. So the, 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 the Oh, cool. I like it. I love it. It's very impressive. I mean, no, no wonder you're the coach of 2018. I mean, very amazing. Uh, you know, I want to ask you the question about when we're talking about like business and growing your business and you work with them. And there is sometimes that they see there is this contradiction that maybe you have to put aside your motivations or values when it comes to work or they work together to succeed. Uh, as I mentioned, uh, I'm a performance coach. They, mm -hmm. we, we talk about business. I'm not a life coach, but I'm doing life coaching because we're working with human. So yeah. hey, rule number one, I was doing a coaching one-on-one -on -one this morning as a top CEO's multi-million dollar company. But we're back to basic. Uh, question, are you on the scale of one to 10, 10 on 10 happy, nine or 12 on 10? So when you talk about all the next step, yes, uh, we're going to talk about your value. We're going to talk about the business strategy. Yes, we're going to talk about the marketing. All, everything about the machine, about the business is the easy part. Um, human is the one who own, who um, we're going to take care of the machine, who is the business. So if, if most of the time is the, the person who take the lead or uh, working with the business, yes, the value, yes, your mission. You need to find your mission. Oh, sometimes a lot of theory like talking, talking, yeah, you need to find your eggs, you need to do this and that. But when you get back to basic, what you like, what you don't like. I like this, I don't like that. Why? Deep inside of you, there's a little voice that most of the time we, don't, we won't listen. Because here, oh, I have to do this, I have to do that. And this little voice here is always right. And the best example I'll give you guys, look at a baby. A baby is always happy. Yes, sometimes he's crying because he needs to eat, but a baby is always smiling, is vulnerable, is wow, is beautiful. And when you're young, what you wanna do, you can do whatever you wanna do. You wanna be a fireman, you wanna be Superman, you wanna be Batman, you can be all of them. And then you get taller, education, the environment, oh, don't work, no, don't do this, it's too hard. Oh, you think too big? Oh, no, no, uh, you can do that because I try and it doesn't work. So when you get back to whatever you want, um, I think it's, it's, it's the way you're gonna achieve everything you want. So you think that Ian, I mean, a person when, even they're not comfortable in their work, workplace, if they invest in good things and they just have the courage, they can go on even though the environment is not okay? Is this what you say? Hey, if, if your environment is not okay, change your environment. Uh, that's it. Bye-bye, boss. Tomorrow. Um, Usually, are there specific people to whom happen this stuff? You think, I mean, they have like, they are annoying or they are different or they are better than the others. What is this thing? I mean, you work with uh, CEOs and big companies. I mean, do you see that? Do you even know about these things that worries bosses or it does not? Same thing. I'm telling you, most of the time, the first question I'm going to ask when I work with a CEO, if, uh, well, what's the value of your company? $10 million. Perfect. I make you a, a $10 million check right away. Do you sell your company? If they say yes, my, that's mean we, we're going to find a new CEO, we're going to sell it or whatever. So, mm -hmm. As I mentioned, guys, you have one life. Uh, money is one thing. Yes, we, we need material, we need this and this. But most people work for this and happy or successful people working for their passion and the passion gonna pay them 
to do whatever they want to do every day. That's the, the, the two different why 97% of, the, of the, the population is owned by the three percent because these guys understand that it's not about owning one of them, but these guys doing what they love and these one do the nine to five uh, metro boulot dodo and then uh, be thanks God it's Friday. Me, thanks God it's today, it's every day. I don't even know which day are we most of the time. The agenda told me that, oh yeah, Wednesday because I got this show that day, but I don't know um, because I'm passionate about what I do. And you can feel it from the, the screen, from wherever I am. Yeah, I know you knew it. So um, by, by doing with your value, that, that what you don't want to do, I don't want to do this, I do the opposite. That means it's what I want to do. So life, it's easy. It's not hard. People say, yeah, it's not. No, they, they put their own barrier. They, they put on their own cage. And that's why they, they're not truly successful at what they do. And because government, society, education put you there, but who, uh, who told you you have to be in this situation? Oh yeah, it's life, my wife, my this, my friend, my father, my family. See, my parents took many years to understand what I do. Now they, now they, they know what I do because now I get some result. But all those years, why you don't get a job? Why you don't do this? Why you don't do that? And all of a sudden they don't never understand what I was doing and now, my dad's the accountant, see the numbers. Okay, finally, uh, yeah, good job, Jan. But no, it's been like uh, 10 years. I work uh, mm -hmm. crazy, but mm -hmm. whatever. Amazing. I'm, I'm so happy for you. And it's, uh, it's amazing to have someone like you who is so persistent and who believes in himself when others don't. And this is, I think, that we should all do the same. And um, it is very important for me to understand that I know that you work CEOs and there are women and men. So which one of them is like harder to deal with, men or women? <laughs> Are they the same? Uh, it's funny because uh, every quarter I'm working with uh, the, account uh, the, uh, the accountant to, uh, to sit here with the clients and I see, mm -hmm. and it's, it's funny because it's uh, half and half. Uh, sometimes I get more uh, wow. men, sometimes I get more women. Um, I'm working with human. Mm -hmm. uh, so this, who this is for... multitasker? Is there like, it, it, it is different? between each person or like women are think different in business than men are they the same see this is yes and no sometimes women there's you, women you're so powerful you have so much energy but sometimes what happen is they have mo more more than one element their mom business ceo there's a husband exactly. like this yeah. this so you have malls and sometimes yeah yeah strong woman but yes and no uh, emotion is mm -hmm. different between men and women. Uh, you guys from uh, Venus or from Mars or something of opposite, whatever. Um, in business is different, so that that's why um, I love the challenge to work with both. Mm -hmm. uh, um, my question, Ian, the last one before we give, I mean, give away uh, the tip of the day. You know, we'll show you can do it. What does Ian Lajoie choose? Money or fun? Oh, fun for sure. It's not, it's not even a question. Um, because money you can, can have fun without money sorry you can have fun without money yeah for sure having fun alone to, with myself i can put music and having fun yes m money for me money is a result uh if you do the right thing you help enough people and you do your passionate money come yes i'm a businessman yes money is great but um most people chasing money before fun chase fun and when, when i do cold call when i wake up early morning it's not that super fun but this is gonna bring me a result, that's gonna bring me success, and that's gonna bring me money. It's the result and not the opposite that money is gonna bring me fun. No, having fun, making money, helping people, making more money. That's my fun. Amazing. It's, 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 it's such an interesting, I mean, the subject with you. We can go for hours and hours. I wanna thank you so much for having uh, this conversation with us and with our wonderful audience. And I hope that if they have any questions, guys, I'm going to post, of course, his website, Ian Lajoie's website, and you can go and contact him directly. And if you have any comments or questions, please share your ideas with us and write below the video. I wanna thank you so much. And I know that you have a very crazy day, like every single day. I wanna say to my audience in the end of the show that if, I can do it what I want in life. If Ian, look how much he has done in his life, you can do it. So we want to ask Ian, 
what does he have to say today to the audience that they can do it? What can they do? What is your advice? What is a tip that you give to the audience? Hey, whatever you want to do, see it, put the action, add some fun, add more action, and you can do it. Most of the time, it's just one or two action that's missing in the equation, and the rest. Have fun, guys. You can do everything you want. Thank you so much for being with me today. Ian Lajoie was with me. I'm Natalie Restokian, and I will see you next week, and bye-bye.